In this video, we're going to discuss the top four AI crypto coins that can make you rich. So let's get started with the topic. First, a quick disclaimer, I am not a financial advisor. All right, so now let's get right into this video. And before we start and before we talk about these four amazing AI crypto coins, I do want to say that if you actually want to research them and check them out for yourself, all of the links you will need will be down in the description. But now let's get right into it. Basically, what I'll do is I'll first go a little bit over the token, so on Coin Market Cap, and then I'll talk a little bit more about the project itself, check out our websites, explain to you what they are and why they have potential. So let's get right into it. The first token we will be talking about is the Render Token, or RNDR, that's the abbreviation of their token, currently sitting at around a $750 million market cap, which you could consider as fairly high but if you know the project you actually know that this is fairly low render is first of all a very hyped up crypto on crypto twitter there are some links with apple it's actually used in certain applications in the apple store you can also see that it has performed very very well over the last year which is only a good sign of things to come so even though it's already at a relatively high market cap it can still definitely grow so render itself to quickly describe it to you is the leading provider of the centralized gpu based rendering solutions revolution the digital creating process and the RNDR token is in the middle of this whole ecosystem so basically what it allows you to do if you have games or if you have uh, certain animations that need rendering so those could be documentaries those could be videos can be films anything if you want to do that but you don't have the capabilities to do that yourself for high definition rendering this is a decentralized platform where you can actually let that be done for you so i would strongly recommend you to also check out their twitter uh, to actually check out some examples of this in real time because they post a lot of uh, different things that have actually been done for example this by the render network and you can actually see the real value and utility the project brings now the second project, the AI coin, which we'll talk about is the Ocean Protocol. This sits at a slightly lower market cap at $200 million. That's pretty much lower and has performed a little bit less this year, but you can definitely see that it has performed great. Also with the amazing AI narrative, of course, earlier this year, and it's not done yet. I mean, the volume is still amazing and the Ocean Protocol project actually has some amazing value as well. So to briefly explain Ocean Protocol, basically what it is, is it's a data protocol. So right now, you yourself, if you're browsing on the internet, you have a lot of data, right? So everything you do, all the websites you visit, things you watch, there's a lot of data, but now all of that data actually remains in the hands of the platforms or the websites or the companies that you use. And with Ocean Protocol, what they actually try to do is they try to decentralize that data. And they actually have a, an amazing ecosystem, but that's what they're trying to do. So a decentralized data platform, and you can actually use Ocean Protocol or decentralized applications use uh, Ocean Protocol, as you can see right here, to, to have that data in there. So for example, you have a platform to participate in surveys and different data, and you can actually get rewards that way. Um, but way more than that, and actually some, some real world amazing uh, applications. So first of all, it's, it's, it's a great thing. The centralized data is something that is definitely coming up and Ocean Protocol is already being used. And those are the two main reasons why I think it has some real potential. And the Ocean token, apart from that, also can be locked to gain some rewards, which again creates more value for the Ocean token itself, making it a great investment. Now, this next token we're going to be talking about is actually an amazing token as well. I'm very excited about this. It's still at a relatively low market cap at around $300 million, but it's actually an amazing project. It has a huge ecosystem of different AI projects as well. So it's basically all, all sorts of AI projects coming together under one umbrella, and that is what Singularity Net is with their own AJAX token. So Singularity Net itself is an open and decentralized network of AI services made accessible through the blockchain. And basically developers can publish all sorts of services on the Singularity Net network, and then they can be used by anyone. But like I said, they actually have an amazing ecosystem as well, which is still growing. And you can actually find out more about that on their websites. Some of these projects also have their own tokens. So that's definitely interesting to uh, take a look at. But what you're seeing is that if you actually want to buy these tokens, you need AJAX tokens, which creates more demand for AJAX itself. And apart from that, it also brings more attention to Singularity Net that all of these projects right here, like Cogito Protocol, Rejuve AI, and NuNet, which all have their own tokens as well, Singularity DAO as well, they're all doing very well. They're, they're great projects on their own, 
So that's definitely a great thing for Singularity Net as well, if you kind of want to uh, benefit from the good performance of all of these smaller projects. Now, the last project and the last amazing AI coin we're going to be talking about is the Graph with their GRT token. And this is a project you've probably already heard of. It's a very big project. It has a market cap of over $1 billion at this point of time. It's, uh, it's just over it, it's $20 million above that. But the Graph is, is an absolute veteran uh, in the crypto space. It's a huge project, has a huge ecosystem as well, so already very, very valuable, but it still has amazing potential in the future as well. So the Graph project, again, has to do with data. So basically how they describe themselves is as a decentralized protocol for indexing and querying blockchain data. And the Graph makes it possible to query data that is difficult to query directly for decentralized applications. So the Graph is not only a project, it's also a real business. And they actually ask money for that. And basically it works the following. So you have a decentralized application which in this case is the customer of the graph and it adds data to ethereum through a transaction on a smart contract so that's how you actually put data on the blockchain this emits one or more events while processing the transaction so the data actually does something and then the graph node comes in and continuously scans ethereum for new blocks and data for your subgraph that they may contain so subgraphs are created by the graph to query and to index the data and then Graph actually finds that data and, and puts that through the subgraphs to actually update it. And then this data is used to actually update the whole decentralized application and provide it with all the data that it needs. So definitely an amazing project. It is a little bit difficult to understand, but if you actually want to check it out, like I said, check out the links down in the description. But for now, we've reached the end of this video. So if you found this video helpful, please make sure to add a like and add comments with questions I might have missed and subscribe to our channel.